Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here, and today we got another awesome video for you guys. So, we've actually been playing myself, Patchy, and Jigsaw a lot today. Uh, we played earlier, I don't know if it's still in our battle log, it should be. Okay, so it is, uh, Jigsaw's last game isn't in there, but we have Patchy's last Brock game. We got his Brock to 1k, and we got Jigsaw's BB to 1k. Then we started playing with the comp of Rico, BB, and Barley, and as you guys see, we've been, we've been doing a fairly good job winning. Um, I believe we're like... 18 and 1 right now with it so patchy and jigsaw both have their 1ks for their brawlers but i'm four games away and i thought you know why not let's just start recording i know we did rico gameplay two days ago but you guys seem to really 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 like some rico gameplay so we're going to get it out in brawl ball for you guys today it's that map where rico just absolutely destroys pinball dreams so we're going to see if we can face some other top players win four straight games hit 1k and without further further ado let's hop into the video Okay, so here we go into the first game, and what you'd expect in that 1k matchmaking, we're facing three really amazing players. They're going to be facing um, Alec, Sky, and who's the third? I think it was Tyrant Star. So all three of these guys are pro players, officially contracted, really, really good players. So this is obviously going to be a tough game. We're going to be playing with Patchy and Jigsaw, as you guys know. So we actually have faced these guys once so far today. We are 1-0 against them. I'm able to pick up the kill over there on Alec. I'm just going to put the ball in the net. So actually, a really quick start. We scored 25 seconds into the game. Barley being on the right side is really good because it's the weak side on this map. But all he needs is that wall. So he should be fine over there against Sky. This guy's getting a little bit too close to him. So he should probably back off. He's going to go down, but we're going to be able to finish off uh, Sky. We're going to pass the ball to Patchy. He's going to get it on that right side. Put the ball in the net, and that's going to end the game. So that was actually a crazy 50-second game against a really, really, really good team. Um, that high IQ pass. Patchy has a really good brawl ball IQ, and I like to think I do myself as well. So they didn't really see that play coming. We got the super pass to Patchy, and he's going to put the ball in the net. That's going to end a really, really good first game, as all six players here are really well-known in the top brawl community. Let's hop into the second game, and hopefully we face a team just as good, if not better. Okay, so here we go into our second game, and we're going to be facing another pair of three really good players. Now, these guys aren't as good as the three we just faced, but very, very few players in the game are. So we should be fine uh, with the start. So they do have Onita on the left side, who Patchy does a fairly good job against. I'd say it's neutral. They do have a uh, they do have a Shelly, though, which is a really big disadvantage for Patchy. We're going to be able to take out two lanes. The, the uh, Shelly is going to waste or star power, we're going to be able to pick up that kill, and Patchy's going to put it in the net, and the exact same like last time, we're going to take a one to nothing lead 25 seconds into the game, so I'm going to try and get that angle, oh, we're on the other side, actually, okay, never mind, we're just going to take out this bear, Patchy is going to go down, they did have a lane switch, so the Shelly now does counter Patchy, we're going to be able to take out the Nita, the Rico is pretty low, we're going to also be able to take that out, we don't know where the Shelly is, and the Shelly does counter Patchy, and probably has Band-Aid by this point, so this isn't the best situation for us. It will be pretty hard to take out that Shelly. That Rico is in a really good position to get a nice super, so we're just going to back out of that corner. We are kind of stuck here until we can get the Shelly lower. Good kill over there by Patchy. We are going to be able to get the Shelly, okay. So Jig's going to leave the ball in the corner for Patchy to get. We're just going to chill up here and try and do as good damage as we can. Rico just got her sp or his speed boost. Okay, we're able to take out the Shelly. Hopefully we can just block the path for the Rico to shoot. We're going to be able to get that kill. And that is going to end the game. So that's two fairly quick games. This one only took a minute and a half. And we're only two games away now from the 1k Rico, which is obviously really good. So let's hop into the third game. Let's not waste any time. And let's see if we could, you know, get that 1k. So here we go into our third game, and again, we're going to be facing Alex, Sky, and Tyron. So this one is definitely also going to be a tough game. So you're going to back off. You got a good first hit. Brock is super, super good at the start. Um, Mid-game, Brock starts to lose his touch, but he's really, really good when, when all three players are in set spawn position. So it looks like... Oh, okay. So we didn't need to overcommit. If we didn't overcommit, I think we would have scored. Uh, so I guess that's my bad. I didn't think Patchy was going to be getting that kill. So we're about 25 seconds into the game now. We have had all the pressure so far. I don't think there's anyone in here. 
We have them pretty backed up. I'm going to start to utilize the walls for my bounces. Patchy is going to go down. We have Tyrant Star pretty low over here. We're going to be able to get that kill, but we won't be able to stay alive. Jigsaw is doing a pretty good job over there. Oh, uh, he's still alive. Okay, so he's doing a good job. He's able to take out Alec, which is really good. Really well played by Jigsaw. Gonna just shoot that bear over there. Gonna be able to get Sky with one clip. Oh, we missed our super there. That wasn't very good at all. Alex's gonna tap us a couple times, so he's gonna get that save. Patchy's gonna try for the goal, but it's gonna be unsuccessful. So they're coming on over here. I think Alec has super, yeah, so that's pretty dangerous for us. Yeah, this isn't looking very good right now. Good play over there by Patchy to back him up. They didn't go for the ball, which is good for us. Okay, Patchy's gonna go down. Yeah, this is looking pretty tough for us. I'm gonna try last like last attempt super, but that's not gonna do anything. They're gonna score the first goal, a little bit of a spin from Alec, and they're gonna take the one to nothing lead. So again, we're gonna try and stay out of the middle just because there's gonna be a bit of spam shots at the start from the Brock. I'm gonna try and help Patchy out with this bear. So he wasn't able to get the kill on Sky. But fortunately, he got him really low. I should be able to take Sky out. Oh no. Okay, we're able to take him out, but we are going to go down. Let's see what happens here. I don't think it's going to go well for Patchy. Yeah, Patchy's going to go down. I think Alec might just shoot this ball in. Oh, he's going to miss it. Okay, we just got super lucky. We're going to super over here. We're going to probably get Sky out. We're going to be able to get him. 15 seconds left. Tyrant's going to get super, so... I don't think this is actually going to go anywhere. Yeah, 9 seconds left. Nothing could really happen at this point. They're going to be able to get that dub. Alec, where's the spins, Alec? Okay, there we go. He's going to get the spins on. That's going to end the third game. And that is going to be it. So how much should we go down now? Oh, so now we're four games away. Wow. Okay, so we'll play two more games. No, we'll play one more since I don't have that much time. Um... Yeah, it's very unfortunate that we took that out. We, we needed four games. That would have been perfect for the video if we hit the 1K. Really good job by Alec and his team. As I said, they're a very strong team and we're 2-1 and one against them. You know, it could go either way against, uh, against that team. So we're going to hop into one final game. And maybe towards the end we'll record the 1K Rico game. But for now, we're going to record one more. And let's see if it's a win or a loss. So here we go into our fourth game. And this is going to be our second last game. What I decided to do in our like five minute matchmaking was we're going to play this game out. And because I don't want the video to be too long, we're going to skip forward ahead to the 1k game. And we're going to show that. So we are going to go down to their Rico. Oh, he could super shot it in the net. Patch is going to be able to get that save though, luckily. Okay, so Frank does have super. We obviously don't want to be in the range of that. Jigsaw is going to do a good job clearing them out. Oh. Patchy moved them out of my Rico super, which sucks. Uh, oh, okay. I thought that Frank was actually going to hit both of them, but it hit none, which is obviously super good. We're going to be able to pick up that kill on the BB. Again, we're just trying to do as much damage as possible. Patchy's going to run around to the other side. He's going to put the ball in the net, and that's going to give us the 1-0 lead 50 seconds, or 45 seconds into the game, sorry. So we're going to help out Jig with this Frank over here. We're going to be able to pick up the kill. Patchy is going to go down, but he's going to get the... Uh, the primo before he does we're gonna go down over there to that rico i don't know why i took that fight to be honest i had less health and it was just an auto in battle so not a smart decision on my end okay so the primo picked up the ball again patchy supering people out of my distance patchy is gonna go down but we are doing a really good job against the other tanks here we're gonna be able to take out that primo but we're not gonna be able to score because of this rico over here just gonna get a few bounce shots on him Start to hit the tanks again, which is really going to charge my super. He almost got it back. Thought you should put that in the net. Oh, he missed. Well, that sucks. Okay, so Rico really has nowhere to go. So we're going to be able to take him out. Again, unfortunately, this Frank has super. It looks like it's the end for Jigsaw. Patchy had the ball, but the Primo super took the ball. We're going to be able to kill the Primo, and the Primo is going to put the ball into the net, and it's going to be one-to-one. -one. So we should honestly run through this team, because they're not a high-end team, and we're playing 1Ks, but for some reason they're doing really good. I guess our team doesn't do that great against tanks outside of Rico. So we're going to get our super off. We're going to do a good job. 
But anyways, it doesn't really matter because Patch is just going to weasel his way up there and put the ball in the net. So we were able to get the star players who are three games off of 1k right now. We're going to start stop recording and we're going to jump forward into our last game when the time comes. So I'll pick up from there and I'll see you guys there. Okay, so here we go. We have a 998 Rico. Now, if we go onto the battle log here, we're going to show you guys a little bit of what transpired in Brawl Ball. So we lost to Alex team. We beat Alex team. We lost again to Alex. Then we beat Toma Minwoong and Feli. Beat another team. Beat another team. We got super close. Then we lost to OG Feli and Toma. So there's just so many, like, just incredibly strong teams on Brawl Ball right now. Um, Jigsaw has work since so we decided to go to Heist and we've won three straight games versus the same team of Ash, YouTube, Gui Clash, and Gerardoto, who are three really good players. So we got the 998 Rico. We're only one game away. We're on Heist side, sorry. This is a completely crazy comp. It's literally just us doing chip damage and defending the whole time. So let's hop into the Heist game and let's see if we can get the 1k Rico. Okay, so here we go into the last game. Now, for the first time on Heist, um, this is we're not going to be facing Ash and his team. So this is the 1k game. We're going to be going up against... I saw a bull. I think I saw a penny. Did I? Yeah, okay, a penny. This map is really odd. You can run a lot of different comps just because there's only two ways to get to the other side and to do, and to do damage. So I actually kind of really like that penny pick. Maybe you can hit the, the Ike from the other side of the water. I'm not sure. We're going to have to find out. So there's a lot of mid control right here. We're basically waiting for them to become aggressive. This bull hopefully will jump soon. We're also trying to get a super because if we can get a super, obviously we're more likely to get a kill. We're going to be able to take out that barley. So that's going to initiate us moving up as a team. Uh, I also got the bull low. So this is going to be us moving up a little bit. Our main damage on the safe is Jigsaw. It was a little bit too close there. Hopefully I spawn. But you, can, you guys can see Patchy's doing a pretty good job up there. Okay, so we're, we're really close to this bull now. We're going to use our super and we're going to be able to take him out. But we do have a barley on our safe, which obviously isn't good. We're going to go down. Um, they actually launch padded that penny turret. That's very interesting. I've never seen that. So that's a really, really, really good idea by them. I wonder how that's going to work out. But so far, it's doing okay. We got to take out this barley over here. He's doing... He just has so much control. I think we're able to take out the Barley and the Penny at the same time. No, the Barley stayed up. Wow. I thought we got it. Okay, I was planning for the Bull to jump over there. Okay, so we're going to send that Penny turret again. Patchy's going to be able to take that out very easily. Now, Barley's doing a really, really good job with control at the moment. Patchy's going to be moving up and going aggro, but I think he might go down. He's doing a great job at staying alive, though. I hope Jigsaw could pick up that kill over there. We're going to be able to. Patchy's also going to be able to pick up a kill, but we're down currently 11%, which means we have to go up. Patchy's going to take advantage of two of them, go, of two of them going down, and he's going to jump over that wall. Come on. Oh, we're going to go down over there. Hopefully Jigsaw can do damage again, as he is our main DPS. That turret's going to be on our side. We do have an advantage right now. What is it? 21% advantage. We're going to take this out real quick over here. They do have the barley coming. Oh, they got a lot coming at us right now. This is not looking good for us. We got a super going. We're able to take two of them out. We have stuff going on on their safe right now. That is going to be a dub. Patchy with the good defense. And that is going to be the 1k Rico. Now, it actually didn't take that long. It was only one heist grinding session. I think it was two days ago. Then a little bit of brawl today with a cherry of heist on top. But anyways, that's going to end it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. You guys got five really, really quality games today. So this is definitely going to make out for a great video. On top of that, we got the 1K. So GG's all around. Thank you to Patchy and Jigsaw for helping me out. I hope you guys enjoyed. And you guys already know, I will be back tomorrow. I'll catch you later. Peace.